Wednesday. I'm gonna do a few days in my life per usual. And yeah, I'm going over to my other location this morning after our morning meeting. Um, I did not finish my notes from yesterday. I just have been tired. <laughs> what's the, what's new? Um, I only didn't finish one note, so I need to finish that today, and I will. And I will. Um, and then tomorrow, normal day, I'm doing some Botox in the evening tomorrow. And then on Friday, like no plans. Like this is really just gonna be like a very, very regular day in my life. Um, the only difference is Seth is like back at work, so they reported back to work yesterday and they've been having like meetings and stuff so he's usually getting up in the same hour that I'm getting up which is nice. I mean I just like having him up and like seeing him before work. So that's really it. I need to go grocery shopping today because I didn't on Sunday. Yeah. Keep everything said it's time to play ball this morning. Hello Bubba. <laughs> This morning went off without a hitch. I'm about to drive to the gym, but I need lunch. So I'm just eating some leftover um, tofu scramble that I made yesterday. It has like potatoes, spinach, tofu in it. That's literally it. I have no food in my house. We have to go shopping this evening. Like we need to go grocery shopping this evening. So I'm just gonna eat that on the way to the gym. I have to drive kind of, it's not that far, but I have to drive like 15 minutes to get to my gym from this office location. So. I like to leave a little bit earlier to get myself time, but this is kind of a record right now. Three days in a row of me being able to take my full lunch break to go to the gym. Sometimes I don't finish my patients till like 12.30, 12.45, and then I have till two for my next set of patients, but like that's not enough time to get to the gym, so I'm happy with that. This is what it looks like. I smother it in ketchup because I'm obsessed with ketchup. <laughs> pretty good. I should probably heat it up. I forgot to heat it up before I, I don't know why I did that. Huh. It's good though. My afternoon was so slow. I saw four patients this afternoon, but my last patient, sweetest person, is just struggling with something that I am struggling to treat, to be completely honest. And um, I obviously can't give away too much and I don't, I, I never want to like break HIPAA or anything. So just like know that I'm doing my part and the patient's doing their part, but it's just something that like I am having the hardest time treating and I want to consult specialists, but they don't have insurance. So that makes it even harder. And like I'm spending all of my time, not all of my time, but I'm spending a lot of time on up to date, doing a lot of research and yeah. So anyway, that's all I'll say about that. But, um, that was the last thing that I saw today, so I'm a little bit <laughs> depleted from that. And I just don't feel like cooking, so I think I'm gonna pick up some Greek food. Hi, what is he doing? Hey, gorgeous boy. What's your brother doing, huh? He's being bad. Of course he is. Of course he is. Oh, oh. oh his mama's. Dinner is secured. I ate an entire thing of pita on the way home. I got an extra one because I was so hungry. Um, so I ate that. And we just ordered from Hungry Greek. I got the falafel bowl with a side Greek salad and a feta. And it's so big, like there's literally so much food in it that I'm just gonna split it with Seth. It's like cheap for all that food. Who's <gasps> Thinkers, hi! Oh man! Just a lot of stuff going on, that's all. Just just, like, just one, baby? Yeah, look how much there is. I'm going to split it. I could probably eat this whole thing right now. I want to see a little bit. No, you're fine, baby. You eat whatever you want. I just, like, I just didn't have lunch. Oh, there's so much rice. I got a package from the Sarah's Day collection. I did. Cool. Yeah. Those are cute. Leggings and silk. Matching top. Look how cute that is. That's really cute. With this. Cute. And then I got the, this green set. 
in shorts. Ooh, that's really cute. This is cute stuff. Okay. Cute. That's cute. She has launched like multiple lines and this one is like, I think I got stuff from like the first line that she ever launched and I didn't really like it, to be honest, but this one looks really cute. That's cute. Oh, I like that one. Yeah, I wanted to get the shorts in this one, but they didn't have any, they were all sold out, so I just got the top, but. And I just got a white shirt. You never have too many white shirts. That's it. You need what? Yeah. I really think you can never have too many white shirts. Like truly. We just got back from our walk, but I wanted to like really show you those pieces that I got from the Sarah's Day White Fox <laughs> collection because they are really so cute. I'm wearing the first one right now. I'm gonna, the lighting in our room is awful. Um, so I might have to go to our guest room. Yeah, let me go to our guest room. So this is the first set um, and this is the leggings in smoke and then this top is also from her. I'm like obsessed. It is so cute. This is the sports bra. I just feel like it really like sucks you in. The back is super cute. This is the back. Super cute. And I really, really like this. Like I think it's super flattering. This is the shirt I was just wearing. It's literally just like a white t-shirt, but super comfy. And I think it's great for working out because it's really lightweight. I got all of these pieces in a size small. And I think they fit really good. And then this is her... Um, workout set and sea mist. I think the one shoulder is really cute. I'm going to try that on. And then this is like the sports bra that I was the most obsessed with. I wanted to get, um, she had like these shorts in white and then she also had this set in black, but they were completely sold out. So I couldn't get the shorts for this, which I'm so upset about. And then I also wanted to get the t-shirt. I mean, literally I loved everything from the collection, but I have, um, like a pair of white Lululemon shorts that I could wear this with so I was like I just have to have this what are you doing <laughs> we just went for a walk you guys aren't tired okay and then this is the set and sea mist I think this is super cute really flattering I wish I would have gotten another pair of shorts but this was the only color that was left in my size so I would totally wear this to Pilates I think it would be super cute the back is really cute. This is the white sports bra. I'm actually kind of glad that I didn't end up getting like all of the pieces in this because this sports bra is really not super flattering on me, which I'm kind of like, what the heck? Um, so like honestly would send this back because I just don't think it looks very good on me. I'm headed to the gym. <laughs> My morning was like very strange. I saw three patients this morning, which is crazy. Um, and then I was supposed to see four, but my last one, the insurance was not eligible and they were there and on the phone for literally like 45 minutes and the appointment was at 11. And then at 11.45, I was like, it's just not gonna work. So I'm headed to the gym, eating some leftover, um, I think the place is called PDQ, but basically um, somebody gave it, somebody brought it to us for lunch a couple of days ago, so I just, Holy moly. I just have leftovers of it that I'm eating. And today at the gym, I think I'm gonna do, I think it's glutes, cause I'm pretty sure I did hamstrings like two days ago, but this is actually the first week in a long time that I have been able to go to the gym every single day during my lunch period, um, which is so nice. I love like my lunch break. It's, and I technically don't get the full time as my lunch break, I get 12 to 1 and then 1 to 2 is my charting and admin time but to be honest like I would much rather finish my charting and admin stuff like in the evening if I have anything than during lunch because it's nice to just like be like take a step away from all of that stuff and 
when I do that, I feel like, okay, I'm, I'm only at work for however long I'm at work for, I don't know, seven, eight hours versus I'm at work for 10 hours. You know what I mean? It's nice to like have a break during the day. So, um, I feel like I, I hate in my vlogs where I'm literally, the only thing I'm doing is talking in the car. So I'm going to shut up. I'm sorry. I'm home now. I have been re-obsessed with the show Suits. Like, go through periods in time. I finished, like, a bunch of the seasons. Put you guys up. Um, I finished, like, a bunch of the seasons and then just kind of, like, lost interest, I don't know, in it for a little while. And I just saw that it's on Netflix. Okay, my camera's really bothering me. I saw that it was on Netflix and I was like, oh my god, I need to get back on there. So I picked up, I'm pretty sure where I left off. I don't remember like a lot of the details or whatever, but I always loved the show. I feel like I used to watch it like literally when I lived at home and just for like some reference, I haven't lived at home full time since I was 15 because I went to boarding school my junior and senior year of high school. Um, so I would go home like once a month and for the summers, but I like didn't, I haven't lived like at home for a long time and I'm pretty sure that's when this show was on because I remember watching it I want to say like my junior year or maybe it was my sophomore year I don't know when I when it came out but I graduated high school in 2014 so I don't know and I could have been late to it but it's so good like it's so good it just there's always something you know anyway I'm making dinner tonight I am making um like uh cowboy caviar I think I actually made that in my last vlog. But my last vlog was actually a couple of weeks ago when I filmed it. So yeah, we haven't had it in a couple of weeks. So I'm gonna make that and eat dinner. Seth has volleyball practice until six tonight. So it's our first volleyball practice of the season. So I'm anxious to hear how that goes. It's his second, um, second, What's it called? Season coaching. He's the athletic director of the school, but he doesn't coach all the sports because that would literally be impossible. So, um, but he is a really good volleyball coach and he loves volleyball. So, and he's got a really good assistant coach and he got like a co athletic director this year. So, I'm hoping it like takes a lot of the um, burden off of him. And it's a girl that we went to college with. So, I think that they will drive really well. So, anyway. <laughs> I'm really hungry, like I need to eat. I forgot to show you guys my dinner, but it looked the same as the last time that they had it. And I'm gonna do the dishes. I'm thinking that there's a smell coming from in here and it's because our food, pro not food processor, what is it called? Our thing that eats the food down here. Um, <laughs> food grinder, I don't know. I can't think of the word of it, but it's broken. And I don't think Seth knows that to fix it. And it's it's emitting a smell. Time to relax, take a shower, and read my book. Just gave myself a little blowout. I've been like obsessed with my Dyson and Air app lately. It gives me like a really good blowout. And I'm just hoping it'll stay. Because my other one that I gave myself like last week kind of stayed. So, yes. <laughs> Friday, we made it. Just taking my vitamins this morning. I made a bad decision and like peaked at my schedule for today. Yesterday, I had a very, very busy morning. Um, meh, you know, I am making my morning coffee as I do every morning. When I make a latte, I like to use a little bit of a sweet creamer. Just like a little bit. As if I was putting like a couple dashes of vanilla in it. For a little while, I was trying to go to like Starbucks or something on Friday and like treat myself. But you know what? I honestly just forgot this morning. And the only problem about when I do that is I like to have coffee like immediately when I wake up <laughs> to like help me feel better. <laughs> I'm an addict. And I can't do that obviously if I go to Starbucks. But 
I'm bringing my workout bag, but I don't know if I will work out today because I have worked out since last Saturday, so I'm and my body might need a little bit of a break. I did touch up my hair just a little bit, like the front pieces. I've just been like really enjoying a blowout. I just I feel like the Florida summer humidity is gonna ruin it all today. So I'm like you gotta get in the car, I gotta get the air going. <laughs> um yeah, I just like I did it last night like you guys saw and then it, I woke up with it pretty good this morning but I like needed some movement again around my face so it took me like five minutes like to do that. I don't know. I don't like to apply too much heat to my hair so yeah. Alright you guys I just got my brows laminated from a girl that I work with or a statistician who does brows um, at Zoe Medical Spa if you guys are in the area. She did a really good job. I'm like trying to bring it close. I love getting my I didn't get them tinted because I already have dark eyebrows but um I've been like obsessed with getting them laminated this is my second time she did a great job they give you like a little spoolie <laughs> where did the spoolie go I'm, the spoolie is my favorite part a little spoolie to like brush them with afterwards Anyway, so it's my lunch break. I decided to skip out on the gym today because I feel like I have been at the gym constantly this week and I need a little break. Um, Cause I think I'm gonna book a Pilates class for tomorrow. <laughs> um, but anyway, it's just my lunch break right now. I'm running to Starbucks to get matcha latte. Not because I need the caffeine, but I'm just wanting something. I just don't want to be, I don't like to be in the office for my full two hour break. So I just got my brows laminated. Um, had a little bit of Panera bread because somebody brought us Panera. What am I gonna get? Starbucks. I just took some of my Coca Cola since I'm gonna have caffeine. <laughs> okay, this is the drink that I got. It's in. A grande iced matcha latte with one pump of chai and like the matcha and the chai together is really good it is very sweet and I have been meaning to ask or like see if I can get less like how do I get how do I make it less sweet because I know the chai is like most likely where a lot of the sweets is coming from um, but I don't know how to get rid of it so anyway I also love the turtles but I need to drink ice drinks with a straw it's just like I don't know I think it's essential but let's see oh that's good it's so good you guys have to try this I got this um from Emily Kaiser's TikTok I believe like a long time ago and I just tried it for the first time a couple months ago and it's become my afternoon drink because I no longer I'm a person who can drink two cups of coffee um on a weekday because of my anxiety <laughs> so very good me like those are static lines mm -hmm. to prevent it from getting worse so permanent forever this might help smooth them out a little bit okay. lift your eyebrows she has no wrinkles when she lifts her eyebrows oh, isn't that crazy she, she's 32 she getting botox no <laughs> what the hell where is this gene for me they're not bad though how long have you been in NP for uh, almost a year now. Okay, I feel like you're so good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. No. You're gonna feel heavy, like when you move. You probably already kind of feel yeah. heavy. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. no. Hello, puppy! Oh my god! Hi, sweet boy! Oh, whoa! Come on! What? Do you, oh, we did a, Oh, you got a donut? Oh my goodness! Who's are such a golden retriever? Like, he has so many golden retriever features. Oh, yes. Oh, my goodness. You're going to carry around that baby? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hello, sweetie boy. I did Botox on one of my students, so that's why I didn't get home until a little bit later. But it was so funny because we actually found out that we worked at the same hospital at the same time. But she worked in the ICU and I didn't work in the ICU, so that's crazy. But um, I'm going to eat this. It's so hot out here. The fan has to be on. And then hopefully we'll, I don't know if I want to do something fun tonight or if I just want to chill or if I want to like go out to eat. I don't know. We'll see. We'll catch a vibe. 
Look at my 11s, you guys. I've got to get Botox myself. Ah! Good morning, you guys. Today's Saturday, but I just wanted to end this vlog because I am so bad at ending vlog. Anyway, last night, um, my brother and sister-in-law just came over and we just like, hung out for the evening. Like That's literally all we did um, because they are moving. My sister-in-law got into CRNA school, which is so cool, um, back where she's from. So they're gonna be moving back there. So they were here for like a year. It was really nice to have them here, but they're gonna be moving at the end of the month. So um, it was, we never, like Seth and I haven't lived around family um, since we were in, I, since we were in high school, like and lived with our families. Um, because when we lived in Chattanooga, we didn't have any family there, and then we moved here. We didn't have any family here until our brother and sister-in-law came down, um, and it was very nice to have family around for the last year, so we will miss them, but we're very excited for their next adventure. So, anyway, um, I'm going to end this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed the this little few days in my life. It was a good week, um, and I, yeah, we'll see you guys next time, so bye, guys.